Hello friends, welcome back to Cat Practice. Today we will learn how to construct a taper helical spring in Autodesk Inventor software. So let's get started. Go to new, take a standard part in millimeter and go to create. Now here, we will click here and take a 3D sketch. Okay, here you can see a helical curve command. So we will start from the center. First go to home, we will select this plane. Click on the center point and we'll take this green line as the guiding line. Click here. Okay, now you can see it will ask you the parameters. So from here, I'll change the parameter to revolve and height. So we will give the revolution and height. The diameter of this will be 50 mm. Okay, I'll zoom out. And here the height will be of 20 mm. The revolution count will be of 6. Okay, now you are able to see a straight helix. Go to front view. Now this is straight. Okay, so it will asking you the direction. Go to home. So it is a constant diameter of 50 mm. So when I give a taper here, I will take a taper of minus 15 mm. So when I take a taper of minus 15 mm, go to front view, you can see. Here the diameter will uh, decrease towards upside. If you take a taper of 15 mm, so it will be reverse in direction. So the top dial will increase and the bottom dial will decrease. Here we are taking minus side. So minus side will do, the diameter will decrease gradually upside. Okay. Go to home and here, I will click here for the direction. And press OK. Okay. Now here you can see. Go to front view. The diameter has decreased upside. Go to home. Now finish sketch. Now here go to plane. Click on plane. Select this top end. And select this profile. Now select this plane profile. Go to create sketch. Now here go to project geometry and project a point on this go to circle command from this point make a circle here of diameter 3.25 mm enter and finish sketch here we will select this plane right click turn off the visibility now go to the sweep command here you will find the sweep command and it will automatically select the profile this profile has been selected now for path, select this path. So a helical spring is being generated. I'll zoom out. You can see here it is oriented along the path. Okay. And press OK. Now you can see the profile. From here we'll give the appearance. I'll take here the chrome polished black. Okay. So this will look like this. From front view, you can see the actual difference. Here the diameter will be remain 50 center to center. And here, this is going in a taper form. Go to home view. So this will be the final output. So this was a basic tutorial to how to construct a tapered helical curve or a helical spring in Autodesk Inventor Inter software. I hope you like the video. If you do that, please do hit like and subscribe the channel for more such videos. Thank you.